in the morning I was talking about the Namibia president when I gave a prophecy about the death of the president of Namibia last year in November that is going to die and um, what is going to happen in the country I said to the people we need to pray for Namibia which we did and we continue to pray because I saw the coming election will be coming a lot of things is going to change already like I said Namibia I'm not telling you things by proverbs as you know me, I am not that type of pro prophets who do proverbs to confuse people. I speak it exactly as it is because I'm confident on what I say. I don't speak things that come here and twist it again and say, you know, I thought I was telling you crocodile and uh, chameleon. You know, the chameleon that was actually the crocodile. No, I don't do those things like that. That is not prophetic. That is not how God speaks. When God speaks to the children, he speaks to them through the language of the children. And when you hear such prophecy, it's just a manipulation. We call it prophetic manipulation. They manipulate your mind because, you know, they, they, they know that you don't understand. And when things don't go the way they expected, they come and tell you that, you see the chameleon I was saying to you, it was actually the crocodile. And we don't do things like that. When I'm talking, I will look at you in the face. I say to you, in Namibia, on the election is coming, it's going to be a woman who is going to be in the seat as the president of Namibia. It's, right now, I'm talking to you, the election is going to be, it's going to be in the March. Meaning, I'm talking to you eight months before the time that the person to take the power is going to be the woman that's going to rule the country. And this woman used to be a former Minister of Foreign Affairs. I don't know much about her name, but I just know what God told me. She's going to rule the country. Keep it and you're going to see it. Thank God for the God Prophet. He's just amazing.